It's crazy. Never really thought about playing baseball or playing the major leagues at that age. As the sun rises in Arizona for spring training, it begins another chance for Jason Rogers to live his dream. A dream that began with his father back in Georgia. My dad, we were in the backyard tossing, you know. He throwing wiffle balls, I've been doing that. We, we did that maybe up to even when I did get drafted. It's crazy, you know, he still helps me out, still calls me, texts me, helping me out. It's a dream come true so far. There has been a driving force for Rogers that has allowed him to get to where he is today, his will. I guess a lot, I don't know, because uh, a lot of people, we didn't have that six tool when we were younger. You need everything now. You don't see it, you don't see too many guys with all the tools anymore. It's rare, but if you want to play in the big leagues, you got to have it all. With determination for me, I think that kind of came on in junior college with the coach I had. I'm not going to let anything stop me. Like, if it's hitting, I'm going to find a way to get that hit off that guy. I'm always determined to get this pitcher. I'm going to get him that day. He's not going to beat me. I'm not going to let him beat me. Roger's love for the game is simple. For me, it was fun. I played it since I was five, so, you know. My dad really taught me everything about it, for real, you know. Even though I played football, basketball, which is fun too, but I was always better at baseball. With baseball losing its allure to professional football and basketball, Rogers knows that his performance on the field means that it can help young African Americans get back to America's pastime. I've been used to it kind of growing up, but it's tough. You just got to work hard. You got to leave no doubt. Shelby and Darnell Coles told me you just got to leave no doubt, especially for guys like us. You got to work hard because it's not going to be handed to us. Milwaukee Brewers coach John Shelby knows that Rodgers has taken his words to heart. He knows that I'm there for him. I have his back. And uh, anytime I can push him in a direction where I may think he needs to put a little bit more effort into it, uh, I'm going to let him know. And so he doesn't take it personal. He knows I'm here to help him. Because you're always on the road, always living out a suitcase. You don't know where you're going to be. You don't know where your next stop is going to be. The game of baseball has a work schedule that goes beyond a 9-5 to five. for Rodgers. Coming home is where he finds comfort. Ooh, long day. We are away from him, maybe from six to six to six. You know, then come home. You're tired. They have to deal with our problems. Hear about what we do in the clubhouse. How today was. You know, it's been a blessing so far. She's been supportive of me in my baseball career. And now I got this little one to take care of. You just gotta try to balance your time. You know. The pages of Jason Rogers' story are still being written. A story that is defined by the sixth tool.